I would like to take the opportunity to invite Mr. Altamish Janjua Sahab. He's here. This is a great opportunity for you to see him face to face. Please make an effort to meet him. But I really wanted to, I've heard so much of the initiative that he's already taken. I want to hear from him. Just a small remark would be really appreciated. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim, Rabbi Shrahli Sadri wa Yassilli Amri wa Ahlul Uqdata Mil Lisaani. I am elated to be here, sir. Uh, whatever we are doing, we are trying to follow in the footsteps that you have set. You know, the work done by the Canadian Pakistan Business Council is amazing. It's a trendsetter organization that has brought the two countries together. And, you know, we are really, I'm, it's a pleasure to be here. And we are trying to do what, you know, you're doing a fantastic job in education, community service. Tonight is all about you. And I think what you have done is really amazing all over Pakistan. Uh, we really hope that this partnership blossoms. Together you have had made a difference and together we will make a difference in the future. As a trade counselor, I see immense potential between, you know, strengthening the ties of the two countries together. Our diaspora here is the biggest asset that we have. I, my goal, the goal of the consulate, the goal of the High Commission is to really empower this connection and improve the ties that we have together. And you know, the future is all about economic diplomacy. Honorable Minister was just here. She was talking about a billion dollars that we have. My goal in the next three years is to make it at least $1.5 billion. And you know, again, inshallah, if we all work together towards that goal, we can really make it happen. Some fantastic new things are coming from Pakistan. Great things are going from Canada to Pakistan. Ovaz Bai, you know, I think he's an amazing person that I just recently met. Uh, why I would really like to point out is that, you know, usually we have conventionally, con the conventional products like textile coming from Pakistan. But now, over the last few months, the biggest thing coming from Pakistan is actually plastics. So that is a really a good thing uh, that we see diversification of commodities that are coming into the country. La yesterday, I was fortunate enough to meet the Vice President of Barrack Gold. So the biggest foreign investment coming into Pakistan in the next few years will be the investment that Barak is making into record it. So amazing times, really fortunate to be here. But again, sir, tonight is all about you and CPBC. 